Hey guys, uh, in this video I'll be showing you how to insert text in between a horizontal line so that your document looks uh, impressive or looks nice visually. Okay, so we'll start. Uh, let me start with a new fi uh, file backslash document class. Uh, we don't need this square, bra square bracket and inside the curly bracket, so we are write writing article document type is article okay now uh, this is the initial setup we wanted to make now be begin document again document and I want to uh, put the title of the document at the center so let me align it at the center begin center and end center uh, as we discussed in the previous video how do we put a horizontal line backslash line within a normal bracket 1 comma 0 this is the code to get a horizontal line and within a curly bracket I have to give the length of the line let me give it as 300 right so let me save it before I compile it let me compile it so I, I got to see a horizontal line now immediately after this backslash what is this backslash doing this backslash is to double backslash is for new line when I put double backslash so the controller the control goes to new line okay name of the document or document name document name let me compile it so that I can show you what's happening here so now the font is small I have to increase the font how do I do it uh, within the curly bracket within the curly bracket and before uh, your document name backslash and if you want the largest font is H capital H U G E okay this is the largest font uh, if you want to check how I got this you just have to I'm sorry control Z just click the click to this icon so I have tiny script size footnote size small normalize large capital L large capital and uh, large huge and capital H huge so this is the maximum size font I can get so that's why I have given capital H U G E uh, where did it go okay I'm supposed to put it here backslash capital H U G E right if I compile it now so I get uh, the bigger font document name now after this uh, let me show you what if I don't put this double backslash if I compile this see immediately after the horizontal line the controller has put the control has put document name okay immediately after the horizontal line I have the document line if you want this to be in the next line so after this you have to give double backslash let me compile it fine now again after this document name I have to go to new line double backslash and then I have to put one more horizontal line line within a normal bracket 1 comma 0 close the normal bracket within a curly bracket give the length of the line which is 300 here let me compile it so fine so but the distance between uh, document name and uh, upper horizontal line is small let me just give a bit more space there so after this line after this horizontal line this horizontal line in the code is this right after this line so backslash v space v stands for vertical okay vertical space uh, i'll give 0 0.3 centimeter so uh, unit is important here don't forget to put the unit okay 0.3 centimeter is the distance between this line and the document name okay now this document looks nice but if this is bold uh, it visually looks more good right so we'll make this document name as bold how do we do it again outside we have to put one more curly bracket in between this curly bracket okay and outside this curly bracket backslash bf bf stands for bold format okay now if i compile it i get to see the document in bold format okay now immediately after this whatever the document name you want to put 
if we had a logo of our uh, logo of your college or institute it looks more nice right so we can even put the logo so how do we put it right so after this line i'll go to next line new line backslash include graphics with the same default size of the image and image name is cec logo as we discussed in the previous tutorial so it is jpg right now if i run this i get an error right why do i got an error because whenever you are going to insert an image you should use the package right so what is the package name it is use package package name is gra phi cx right now if i compile it okay now i get to see the logo now if there is a space between this logo and the uh, lower horizontal line it looks nice visually we will put the space how do we put the space and where do we put the space after this horizontal line lower horizontal line which is here right so backslash v space v space and we will put 2 cm between logo and the line let me compile it now this visually looks nice okay so this is how we put document name in between two horizontal line